start over here. It may not even start, Joe. <coughs> You wish you hadn't didn't have to go down. It's not too nice to go down in, in the ground when the sun's shining and it makes you feel a little blue. I don't know, there's something about it that you just like to do it. It's got a magnet to it, it drags you there. You know what you got to do the first thing and keep at it all day long from one thing to the other. 
days you had a good days and bad days in the mind you like everyone else. Whenever you go in you, you look at that roof and you'll watch yourself and you try to take care of yourself in there. We've never had to carry a man out. Around 30 years and better. The stretcher has never been unfolded, so we have a pretty good record. This is just seasonal work for mine because I just use it for household and uh, heating and that's all. I don't use it summer and winter like they used to. When the railroads were here, they'd buy the coal and they used to have the thrashing machines would buy it and these creameries and uh, all that to make the steam. Then the more electricity come on, why everything went to electricity.
after you get used to it, your knees get tough. You can do a lot more work by uh, being down on your knees. You can tell a coal miner uh, by uh, looking at him, he's uh, bent over. He uh, has trouble with his back. Come here, Bill. Come here. Come here, G. 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 Get in there. imagine they, was, they wouldn't be over average over three cars of dirt a day this winter, but winter before, and when they're way in there, why, they'd average just about half and half. So we just take it up, dump it up on the, the pile we call the shale pile, and it makes shale, use it on for roads and different things.
Yeah, I often wondered what I'd be doing if it wasn't big and cold. Seemed like you get stuck someplace you can't get out. I was 16 when I started in the mine. Got out of school, and I think I laid home a year or so, and then I went to the coal mine. I started in the coal mine, I think I was getting $2 a day, a couple of empties. I've been in since 1916. I'm ready to give it up. Getting too old. Close to seven there now, I might as well, what are you gonna do? I think uh, a man would open a mine up, he could get anybody to work in it. All the uh, guys is left now, and no young fellas is taking it up. Last of August, I've done it for years, we'd start in the mine. So I was just thinking about it the other day. It seems kind of funny now that I'm not going to go back to the mine. I've been in them long enough that I kind of like it. But you know, when you get so old, well, it's a different story. I used to like it. I've worked a long time in them, and uh, I think it gets in your bloodstream. And I just like to work in them. I don't know why. 
Kind of grows on you. After 43 years, that's about all you know. Something that you've done from a, from a time you was a kid on, why, it's just a habit. Well, I think that uh, there'll be a time it'll come back, but uh, I think they'll have a different method of taking this uh, coal out of this ground.